when I saw you standing there. I can't believe how fast the time has gone by since I met you, Nick. This feels kind of weird talking to you through a camera when I see you almost every single day. But that used to not be the case. The memories that we've created and things that we've filmed have not even compared to just how much that you've taught me as a human being and how much you'll continue to teach me because in 40-ish days you're going to be my husband and I'm so excited yet very interested to see what all changes and what we're going to be like as a couple. Comes once in a lifetime for the first time I believe it to be true All of my friends say When you know, you know There's a lot of memories that you and I share that no one else knows about and that are just really special to us and I know that you don't really like a lot of attention on you whenever we do videos and stuff together but I wanted to make this video for us to have and for us to look back on mostly just that reason and also just to show the public just how much I love you and how much I appreciate all the things that you've done for me. One of the biggest things I admire about you is how consistent you are. You're just giving of your time, you're giving of your energy when we're together. It is really just fun to hang out with you and I enjoy just sitting in your presence. We don't even have to do anything. and. I think that takes a special person and I'm glad that I'm marrying you because there's going to be a lot of times when we're just sitting together. Just seeing the person that you are day in and day out and how you're changing and how you're growing. And I think that you're a completely different person than I met two years ago. And I think that's an amazing thing and I'm so glad that we get the opportunity to grow and I really hope that you think I'm a different person than you met two years ago because that person was weird. Every piece falls into place when I'm with you. And you have found the love that sets me free. also love your determination for your goals and what you want to accomplish in life and just how much of a hunger you have for knowledge knowing that you're gonna have another fun fact for me or you're gonna tell me about the latest report that you read in an article I love the fact that we had a long period of long distance because I got to learn about you and the way that you communicate within the first year and that's all we knew and so I think the way that God set up our relationship and the way that he's guided us the past two years has been just so intentional and you've never taken any period of time in our relationship like lightly and I think that you want to see us just grow and you want us to have a similar mission and a similar frame of mind. That's what marriage is about, just having the same goal and going at it together. I also love how spontaneous and accepting you are of the fact that I like to try a lot of new things, especially at restaurants, and you don't get upset at me whenever I order tacos at a nice steakhouse because I'm just in the mood for tacos because a girl likes her Mexican food. Going on with the first thing that I said about you, which is consistency. I think something similar to consistency is also just over time seeing what that consistency has done within your heart and the way that you treat me, our relationship and other people. You've grown to be this guy that is just so dead set focused on what he wants which is not even like a self-absorbed goal or dream or vision but to actually see people 
saved, which means having the hope and the love that Jesus Christ promised whenever we accept him into our hearts and our lives. And I think that's so amazing to see you live that out and you push me without even having to say anything to do that for myself. And I'm really excited to see how our marriage will grow in that area. And I'm just thankful for the fact that you say hard things, even whenever it might hurt to hear. There's been a few times when I've been sick, just like a few weeks ago when I had shingles and both you and I were both blown away by the fact that I had that and I got a rash, but you went to CVS like three times to pick up different things because certain things weren't working and I was burning and stink. Like it was just an awful experience. But you were there and you stuck with me through it even whenever I was crying and like just agonizing in pain. And I don't know why my eyes are watering. I guess I'm emotional. Just kidding. I think it's cool to see how those moments over time will build on each other and what will become because of it. I will be with you forever. good looking <laughs> and I will say that lightly it's really hard for me the past two years to just like be like yep I like that I want it um, but let's wait and it's been hard but I know that you as my husband and I as your wife like us being able to be together in the way that it's meant to be is gonna be so special. I'd say probably one of the last things that I'm gonna mention is just how free you feel to be yourself around me, which I'm really thankful for. You always say that you never really hold back anything from me and I need that because then I feel free to be myself too. And sometimes I feel like you're a little too much of yourself uh, and I won't go into detail, but <laughs> I love the fact that you love animals just as much as I do and you love dogs and we sound like just too excited about this sort of stuff but to us having a dog is gonna like change our world and I'm excited. I think the last thing I'll say is just how thankful I am to God for the way that he set up our relationship and the way that he continues to just show his hand in everything that we do. He's given us so much grace in the midst of mistakes and you know, just us being self-centered sometimes and pride gets in the way. And so whenever we humble ourselves and just enjoy each other's presence and just figure out the fact that we've been gifted with each other, it's just so cool to see how having that mindset changes the way that we treat each other. And I'm just thankful for you being the way that you are and the fact that you chose me and I am blown away every single day because of it. Sometimes you get on my nerves, but majority of the time, I'm just really thankful to have a person like you to spend my life with. So I'm looking forward to the next month or so of planning and preparing our, our hearts and just enjoying the time that we have in engagement and then moving into the next chapter and the next step. And that's really it. Hopefully you didn't think this video was too cheesy and you didn't mind me putting it on the internet, but I think it's really cool that we can go back on my channel and see this. And for those of you who watched this super long video of me just saying how much I love Nick, and what I really like about them. Thank you for that. I love y'all. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you, Nick, for watching this video. I don't know how I'm gonna tell you that I posted this about you, but yeah. All right, guys, I will see you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed this Wedding Wednesday video. It was just kind of a special monumental one. And we get married. Deuces. Thank you.